Well, Fremantle's 130-year-old town hall has been given a new lease on life. It's taken a year and more than $3 million, but today the largest restoration project completed by the city was unveiled. A century-old bell ringing in a new era for Fremantle's town hall. Built in 1887, the 130-year-old building has undergone a multi-million dollar restoration to keep it ticking for years to come. The facelift took 250 specialist tradespeople a year to complete. In total, $3.1 million was spent on what's become the largest restoration project in Frio's history. This is one of these projects that you do once in a generation and you do it right um, because we want this building that's been here for 130 years to be still looking this good in 130 years time. It's been a long process. We first started looking at the building in 2012. There was a storm and some tiles blew off the roof but the more we looked the more we found and it became the project that it is today. For the first time in a decade the Australian flag is once again flying high above the town hall. Until today extensive weather damage had made it too dangerous for people to access. The revamp is the first part of a major $270 million transformation of Fremantle King Square, which includes a controversial new $50 million council office building. I'm sure that in 1887, the mayor at the time got a bit of flack for saying you know, around this, this town hall, but it's been a building that's endured and I think that, um, that people love. And I think what we're doing with the King Square project is investing in Fremantle's future. Nathan Brooks, Nine News.